Hey, Low Riders! Welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to tie a really amazing killer bass bug. Easy to tie. We're going to whip this baby up. You're going to take it out to the river, lake, whatever, and catch some serious bass. So let's get right to the vise right now. We're gonna take, first thing we're gonna do is prepare a piece of rabbit. I got orange, you could use different colors. But you're gonna strip, cut a piece about two and a half lengths of your shank or hook. And then you're going to strip the fur off of it for about the shank, the, the length of the shank of the hook. But you could tie this in right behind the eyelet right back to the bend of the hook. So you're gonna strip this, you can see the one side's made of leather, kind of type surface, the other side is the rabbit strip. And you're gonna strip this at the length of the hook. Now the thread we're gonna use in this fly is 210 denier pink. You can use red or whatever color. It's gonna put a hot spot for this fly. Bass just love that. Keying on them hot spots. Now you're going to tie in that strip, a rabbit, right behind the eyelet. You better pull that back, Donnie. It's a little over the eyelet right now. But you got to get, make sure you clear the eyelet. Don't cover up the eyelet of the hook. Now we're going to tie in some flash. Now we're going to tie in a whole bunch of strains of this. What I usually do is double it over or triple it over because you only want it as long as your tail. So I double it or triple it and then cut it off. Cut down on waste. Tie that in. Like I said, cut it off the same length of the tail, or a little bit shorter if you want. Now we're gonna take that strung marabou like I used for the white SOB. So we're gonna Basically, finish this like the white SOB. I'm gonna tie that in the base. This will give it a really fluffy action. Now you're gonna just wrap that towards the eye of the hook and make sure you leave enough to tie it off when you get to the eye of the hook. You wanna use up most of the feather because it'll make it big and fluffy. 
you get to the eye of the hook, tie it off. Form a head with your thread. Now you're going to throw on a whip finish. And you see I caught some pieces of the marabou here. Don't matter. You can break them off later. Just leave them there. Don't matter. The bass ain't going to care. You can just see the action this marabou has, even just with this little breeze blowing in the time room. You're going to have a lot of action. I didn't put no weight on it so you can fish it clear, close to the top or add weight to fish it lower, below the surface. It's going to be a deadly fly. I hope you like that bass bug. That's going to be a deadly, deadly fly. So, get these tied up. Do some bass fishing. Get away from them trout. Try something new. Keep your lines wet, out of the trees, and give them only give them fish a sore lip. Catch you on the next video.